Good morning, sisters. I'm out for my morning walk. And I was just thinking about our fight, flight, freeze, flop responses. Um, I will always stop on my walk when there are caterpillars or slugs um, or other creatures in the road and I'll pick up a leaf or something to help them um, off to the side so they don't get smushed and, and run over. And it's really interesting because some some caterpillars, some slugs, they immediately I bring the leaf towards them and they curl into a ball and they get very, very still. Okay, so they freeze. And it and it's very easy to pick them up with a leaf and bring them to the side of the road. Other caterpillars and slugs, they don't like the leaf and they they move away from it and they look at it with distaste and they keep crawling and I try to push it under them and they move in the other direction. Um, they're moving away. And so I started thinking about, um, yeah, yesterday, all of the slugs and caterpillars um, rolled into tight little balls and it took me two seconds to bring them up and put them to the side of the road. Today, all the caterpillars were like, get away from me, I don't wanna do this. And so I started thinking about, um, our nervous systems and just how helpful it is when we can notice how are we responding to situations and is our nervous system resilient and versatile? Do we, do we engage in different pathways of response or do we always stick with one? And so my question to you is, what is your nervous system response? Um, for me, I had a stressful experience yesterday and I checked in and I, I went into flight. <laughs> and physically I left the situation. <laughs> um, and you know, and, and I cleared that. And what I find is that when we can notice what our nervous systems are doing and we, when we can notice if we're stuck in a particular pattern and pathway, um, that can really begin to shift things for us as we begin to just notice. So the first question really is, what are my habitual responses? Um, when I'm in a stressful situation, when I get activated, um, what happens for me, and do I get stuck in that place, or or does it move through? Um, so thanks for joining me um, for a little piece of my morning walk and for thinking about caterpillars and slugs and and our nervous systems together. My name is Moon Title. Um, my practice is Presence Heals. You can uh, check out my work at PresenceHeals.com. I'm also the co director, excuse me, of the Women's Wellness Circle, and you can find our work at womenswellnesscircle.com. All right, enjoy the day.